Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Darkest of Dungeons. Last time... What did we do last time? I think we just did a milk run last time. Let me look back at our... Uh... In time, you will know the tragic extent of my failings. That's not the right place. Let me go look at our... Not our glossary. Which one is it? I think it's this one? Yeah, okay. So... All right. Yeah, the last mission we did was Sir Judicale, our antiquarian, and Wiggles going out, or and Rue as well, going out to uh, do basically a milk run. Made us quite a bit of money, which I believe we have already spent on various upgrades and such. Yeah, everybody level two or above is upgraded except for Olbrecht, and that's because I don't really know what I want to do with Olbrecht. Um, some quick logistical stuff before I get started. Um, we have a name for Pistris. So, let's go ahead and give it to her. This is a rather classic name. She is going to be Ripley. And I think her color is probably fine as it is. So, she has been named. Uh, other things. I am expecting I may get a phone call. My lawn is actually being mowed at the moment. So uh, if they finish up or they need something from me, uh, they were going to, you know, ring the doorbell or call me or something like that. So I may have to put in some cuts here and there. So might see some interruptions, but uh, on your side, you won't see it. But just something you might notice is like I might there might be a jump in the video or a cut or something. That's why. So, nothing to worry about. Just uh, taking care of some around-the-house matters. That's all. Uh, what do you have? A tapeworm? That's right. I didn't want to treat that because I don't really need to right now. Okay. So, we got a couple bosses we can do right here. Or we could go do some normal runs. All right. How many people do we have at that level 2 threshold? We got quite a few, but none of them are really tanks, except for maybe Judicale, you could say. I guess we could take Judicale. Here. Let's clear it out. Because I, I feel like doing a boss. I don't know which one. Sonorous Prophet. Okay. If we're going to do him, then I like this group. Because he's a bit of a nasty cake. Of course, the other problem with him is... Uh, Judicale isn't super great for dealing with him, so... Uh, unfortunately, I don't really have any tanks that are right now. So, I don't know. I guess either one, you were really going to want to take these guys, because we need somebody who can target a variety of positions, um, based on what I know about these bosses, so... Let's see. I kind of feel like I want to do this one, actually do the one in the Warrens, because the Ruins is going to be a little harder to do with the Houndmaster, just because uh, the Bleeds are not nearly as effective. He's going to be in the second position, so we're going to want him to have that. Let's see. You're good. And I would say you're good as well. So now, let's go through and equip everybody. You have Ennui, which isn't a real big deal. All right, um, who gets Dismas's head? I think you get Dismas's head, along with the Wrathful Bandana. Now you are uber damage. Uh, you get the Houndmaster's Collar, and I don't really have the other item I like using on you, so we're going to give you the Cudgel Weight to increase your stun chance. You get this and this. You get the, the classic super healing combination. And you get... Let's give you the Knight's Crest. And... Thinking this one. This one. There's a lot of beasts in here. If I'm doing the one I think I'm doing. Let me make sure that I didn't get confused. That's the one I want. Okay. 
I did get confused, and I almost went on the wrong one. That would have been bad. Okay, so with so many beasts, I think we're going to go with the damage 25% against beasts. Lowers his dodge a little bit, but we can ultimately get around that. Now, that would be nice, but I don't really know if that's necessarily worth it when we're looking at 25% damage. So, yeah, I think this is going to be a good group. Let me see. Okay, there is actually one thing, two things I want to do. But I'm not sure I can actually afford them now that I think about it. Let me just go look. How much is this? Yeah, that's a little out of my price range. I'm happy with their uh, skills right now. Okay, so we are going to do we are going to go after the Enchoet flesh. Some things were never meant to live. Cleanse the sin of the ancestors' experimentations and put this abomination into the abyss where it belongs. Sounds cool. I like it. All right, we're going to bring 10 torches. We're going to bring three shovels. Uh, enough food for a feast. One check, two check, three check. And then we're going to bring plenty of these. Uh, one more of these. A couple of these. And a few of these. Torches, shovels, food. Trinkets, all equipped. Okay, pre-flight checks have been done. Let's go. My zeal for blood rituals and summoning rites had begun to ebb, as each attempt invariably brought only failure and disappointment. Progress was halting, and the rapidly accumulating surplus of wasted flesh had become burdensome. Hmm. Okay. The thing is more terrible than I can describe. An incoherent jumble of organ, sinew, and bone. Now, where the heck is the boss in this layout? It's just a grid. I have no idea where they've put the boss. Well, that's interesting. Ouch. Curious is the trap maker's art. His efficacy unwitnessed by his own eyes. A little bit of damage, a little bit of stress. We got a blockage. Such blockages are unsurprising. These tunnels predate even the earliest settlers. Okay. Still nothing to fight, but we did get some scouting. Okay. Oh, we got a lot of scouting. My goodness. All right. Well, it looks like our main battle is going to be down here. So let's go this way. Hunger. That's a check I was hoping we could avoid. Okay. Hmm. You know, it's probably too far away from the boss, because if this is a, just a battle down here, I'm assuming the boss is over in one of these two corners, so that's a long ways away. I don't really think there's much point to trying to save this for the boss, so... We're going to use the herbs. Give her another 30% damage, so just so you guys know, she is now plus 50%, plus... 75% damage. Wellafrey is going to be wrecking shop. And she's going to be the first to get vomited on. I would have been really mad if I'd gotten a disease right there. Uh -huh. Holy crap, our team is slow. Unmoved. Unbalanced. They are all going before we are. We are really slow. Uh, you don't really need anti-venom for that. Come on now. Let's do group heal. Okay. Let's go ahead and zealous, zealously accuse the maggots. Confidence Kill two of them the with Hound's Harry. Get these guys bleeding. Continually onslaught. Destroy. Them all we gotta do all. is take this guy out. And he should be dead. Yep, he's dead. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Easy money. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. 
All right, now we got another fight here. Oh, hello. Okay. That's fun. Well, um... I guess let's do as much as we can to this guy, huh? All right, that was what I was hoping for was the stun. And you can't really do much to him right now, so we'll just have you do the sniper shot. Or the wine fire shot. The ground quakes. Oh, wow. Look how much health he has left, guys. We wrecked him and wrecked him hard. We might actually be able to kill him before he gets to act. Nope, he's going to get to do something. Damn. Still, I think we got a good shot at killing him this round, which is really impressive. Like, if I can get a little bit more damage on him, he's done. And it's... What's his chance to bleed? 20%? Eh, just finish him. As the fiend falls, that was easy. A faint hope blossoms. <laughs> wow. Talk about wrecked. Um, let's just blind fire. Obliterated. Nice. That's annoying. So he's basically back at full health. And slapping my Houndmaster for some significant damage. Let's just heal that off. Alright, Vestal. Nope. Leave. Mm, let's try this. Their formation is broken. Nice. Maintain the offensive. Really nice double kill right there. All right. So I feel pretty good about this group if they can wreck a collector like that. My goodness. Packs laden with loot are often low on supplies. That is true. But uh, we're not going to worry about that right now. Oh, cool. We got more scouting. Another room battle. And there's the boss. Okay. Well, I want to do some exploring before the boss. So we're going to go up here. We're going to grab this torch. If only treasure could staunch the flow of otherworldly corruption. Okay, and then I want to go over here real quick. Oh, crap. We are kind of getting screwed over. No, come on. We can get food from that, damn it. And we're a little short on it right now. Ugh, okay. Um, let's go here. Because I'm a little worried about the food shortage. And I don't want to get into a really bad situation where I'm going to be very, very low on food. Alright, we need to torch up. Let's torch up one more. Okay, we're at five torches, so we're not too bad. Madman! He is going to be priority one. Especially with that jibber-jabber he's talking. Alright, your stress is getting up there. Um, why don't you mark the madman so we can make sure he goes down this round. You heal. Kill the madman. Really? Uh, I put all my eggs in that basket and it just screwed me. Well, at least we got a kill still. Oh dear. Yep. That's bad. Kill him. Thank you. Okay, now what? Let's stun this guy. Okay, all we gotta do is deal with him where it hurts. We can absorb that fairly easily as long as it's not a crit. You start doing damage to him. Alright, I don't see much point in shifting you guys around. 
just to get the damage bonus back on uh, Wellafray, so. I think we'll just, wow, that is a massive crit. I think we'll just focus on uh, doing damage. If he bleeds, he dies, he bleeds, Slowly. he dies. Gently. This is how a life is taken. All right. Oh, excellent. We got Success some food. So clearly in view. Of course, we can't or carry is it. it. Merely a trick of the light. It's garbage. Let's get rid of it. I want. I need a little bit of extra food. Okay. What do we got in these other rooms? Multiple treasure rooms. Well, on the one hand, I would like to explore those, but I'm also running out of uh, options as far as food. So why don't we do this? Let's go this way. Let's fight this battle. Easy battle. Should be anyway. Skeletons are not going to bleed, but he is. Not too bad. It's not a really severe blight or anything. Um, let's just another bowl bowl of those dudes. And go ahead and kill it, I'd say. Be wary. All right. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. That is getting left behind. Because those are just 250, so I'm not too worried about them. Open the trap up. What is this? Okay, it's just a normal pack. Gray has a steal my stuff trait. That's annoying. He has Hylomania. Okay, fair enough. That's not a terrible one to deal with. Um, we're going to need one more torch here, so let's do it. In Radiance, may we find victory. I may have made a mistake. Squirming, but I hope. Contorting and ever-expanding. This horror must be unmade. Okay. Ouch. That's kind of horrifying. That just came out of a pig's ass, it looks like. And that horse head has really terrifying teeth. Actually, I think that's a pig's head now that I think about it. Okay. Let's mark the one in the back. Oh, there's so many actions. Holy crap, I just realized you have, like, well below half your health. How did you get so low all of a sudden? I guess they did all hit you, didn't they? All right, let's try and get a bleed stacking. Because multiple targets, they all have one hit point, or one hit point bar, rather. I think that's probably a good thing to do. Okay. Let's hit that thing, because that healed him. It is now a bone thingy. Here comes another butt snake. Ouch. That is a lot of damage. My goodness. Oof. Okay, she has a nasty blight on her. That's why she's taking so much damage. Speaking of damage, you see how much health we've lost? My goodness. Okay. Dog treats. Let's stack some more bleeds. Oh, Lord. Okay. We don't have any venom, do we? Okay. So she's going to take priority for the healing for a while until that ticks off. Oh, my God. That's low damage. Oh, they all have different protection values. I didn't know that. Ooh. That's the one that doesn't have any protection. Well, if there was ever a chance to do damage, I think this is it. He's going to get a lot of health back. Ugh, jeez. Okay, you need to heal yourself. Mmm, it's 
bad. But it's not super bad. Okay. Go ahead and mark, because our real damage threat is her. Oh my god, I forgot to shift them. I am so dumb. Okay. Ooh, that's what I like to see. Oh, Jesus. All right. Okay, we just gotta survive this. Oh, God! Three health. Three health and he's bleeding. He has one health. Uh, Hound Harry, dude. Stack more bleeds. Okay, we need to kill this thing. Like, now. Okay, which one has less prot? This guy? Ugh! Okay, I think... One more, and it's dead. Yeah. It is as grotesque in death as it was in life. Okay. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. So that was a little scary, but we made it through okay. So why don't we go ahead and camp like Circle right now? Circle in the dark. The battle may yet be won. We'll go ahead and feast. All right, we are really bad off on health, so let's do some serious healing here. Um, that reduces your stress and prevents ambushes, so I think that's worth it. Do I have anything else that can heal? Not really. So I guess let's do restring crossbow and buff up your damage. And 11 and 12. Hmm. You don't have any stress, so that's pointless. Healing is probably my best uh, thing to do here, so we'll heal. Okay, I am coping well despite the madness all around. Plenty of blood left to shed this day. I'm glad to face these dangers with all of you. The cool. match is struck. A blazing star is born. They've got camaraderie, guys. Okay, what's more important? The treasure? All right, let's do it this. Let's do a circuit this way. So we're going to walk this way. We will not delay. Got a little bit of money. We got two hunger checks in us. I really want to try and get to both of those treasure chests if we can. Okay, spiders, but we surprised them. Let's do a bola. Executed with nice. impunity. Um, I'm thinking we need to do group healing here since we can take advantage of it. Just to get everybody up close to full. Okay, you kill one. Another abomination cleansed from and our you lands. And that's a fight over in one round. Splendid. This expedition at least promises success. Okay, why don't we go over here and see what this is? Maggots, easy. Especially when we surprise them. All right, let's do one more group heal. Top everyone off. Get some free stress relief out of it. That's nice. Masterfully executed. All the maggots are bleeding. Back to the pit. Uh, you just gotta hit him. Be gone, fiend. Foolish horrors. Brought low and driven into the mud. Alright, man. We are cutting through this place pretty Wealth good. beyond measure. Mm. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. We're gonna toss the dog treat. That's not really necessary at this stage. Okay, so I'm thinking, why don't we go up here? If we can find some more food, that would be fantastic. Because that would allow us to check more of these halls for potentially valuable curios. All right, let's go back up here. We got a pack. We got more food, nice. Waiting to be spent. If we get two more food, we have another hunger check. Uh, and then our 
The limiting factor is going to be light, but I am alright with going lightless for a while if need be. We've already beaten the boss, so we've already succeeded. All we would really need to do is run if we run into real trouble. Okay. Yep, we're going to bleed for some more. That's probably going to blight her. Yep. And this should take care of you. Nice. Okay. Victory, but a victory nonetheless. Now we'll sweep the treasure rooms. We got a sack. The sack has some treasure in it. Okay, we're gonna start running into some darkness problems. Okay, the acolyte we have to kill because she's gonna be all the stronger in the darkness. Yeah, 18 stress, that's bad. Oh, Jesus, okay. Um, do I wanna get on top of the healing here? I think I do. <laughs> all right, you are dying. Good dodge. Good. She's finished. Now we just need to leave. It fell just short of killing them. That sucks. And they get to go first because they're really fast. Of course. Alright. Cleave through them a little more. Oh, wow. We are getting As really lucky with this mount, So too will resistance. Now if we could just get some torches, we'd be in great shape. Okay, vomitorium begins. He is bulimic. Wonderful. You're bulimic, Gray. That's a problem. Let's get everybody bleeding. All right, the munchiness begins. I really hate how they pretty much all got to go before we did too. That's, that's some garbo. Let's do a blind fire, get your speed up. That should allow you to go before this guy next turn. Uh, let's do some AOE healing. Yep, I know you need anti-venom. Oh, wow. That's some damage. Really? His speed is seven. Such a terrible assault cannot be left. Oh unanswered. god. Okay. Stress is starting to pile up a little bit. A decisive pummeling. Good job stunning him. It's just blind fire again at this point. Okay. She should be able to go far faster than him, so I'm gonna leave the vomiter to her and just do a bunch of healing this turn with everybody else. Okay. Blind fire finishes the fight. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Um, do I have the whole place scouted? I do, so I don't need shovels anymore. I'm gonna leave that, though, I think. Okay, let's use a key. Hidden compartment. Littering gold, trinkets, and baubles. Paid for in blood. Alright, no reason to go that way, because that's just a trap. Hunger check. We have plenty of food for it. We want that. We do not want the shovel. Let's toss the citrines. Okay. Now after this, we can toss the keys as well because there's no secret rooms and there are no curios in here in the halls that require keys. All right. Oh, that sucks. Okay. Stress is becoming a little problematic. We need to kill that little bastard in the back. Oh, good. She's going to get stunned. Of course. Alright, let's 
Let's get him all bleeding. He got crit, so he's dead. That's good. Praise the steadfast hound! Reeling. Oh my god. The stress is a little out of control, to be completely honest. Okay. We can try and do some stress healing once more these guys are dead. A death by inches. Right now, though, I need to get some enemies down. Because we're getting a little messed up here. That is not the one I wanted to kill. I should have used my targeted ability. Okay, stun him. He's gonna get his turn back. You're gonna stress heal. He's gonna do some extra, which is fantastic. Uh, blind fire, and it's dead. I was kind of hoping we could get a little more stress healing done, but we'll take what we can get. All right. Um, there are curios that will require multiple of these, so I don't really want to. I don't really know what I want to throw away for this stuff, but I do want to throw something away. The bandages are probably the thing that gives us the least benefit, so why don't we toss them for the crests? And then we'll use the key. We will pick up what we can. Throw away the keys. Let's go over here. We got a torch. I am actually gonna leave a that. Some reward for a task well performed. As I want the darkness. Because in the darkness, we can get way more treasure. All right, that's a curio we have already gone by, so we don't need to worry about it. Um, there's only one curio we have not explored. It's this one down here. It's a crate. What do we get? Hmm. All right, let's toss this. And that looks pretty good. So, yeah. I think that's going to do it. Let's go. All right. So we got about 15,000 out of that trip. Several crests, a pretty good mix of heirlooms there, actually. And we got the Holy Orders, which are of minimal usefulness. Might be good if you gave them an item that uh, reduced their virtue chance or something like that. I've always thought this might be really good to pair with, uh, with the Martyr's Seal. Just because it's um, it's got virtue chance increase and death blow resist increase, but... I have never actually tried that because that's living way too dangerously for me. And Judicale is now level 3, so we can't take him to the other boss. Damn, I was hoping he wouldn't level up here. That is... Good. I mean, he does have a range skill, which is his uh, Zealous Accusation. So I guess it makes his Zealous Accusation better. I can't complain about that. And she got Manslayer, which is also pretty good. Unfortunately, where it would be really good is if I could take her to fight the Sonorous Prophet, which I can't. I remember days when the sun shone and laughter could be heard from the tavern. Yes, laughter. Yes, indeed. All right, we're going to sort everybody by level. Okay, so we got some diseases. Bulimic is not great. Ennui is not great. Uh, well afraid did not end up with a disease. None of those diseases, I think, are bad enough to justify really going hard on the healing, so... We're not gonna worry about those. Now, since all of them just got leveled up, I'm gonna make sure that their skills are as high as I can get them. Mm -hmm. Uh, Judicale. Okay, everybody's good. I might want to invest in Holy Lance at some point, but I don't think now is the time for that. 
we need like we have the portraits we do not have the crests to go to instructor mastery level four we do however have the hero resolve levels we need to level up to that level so we might want to consider that as our next big thing yeah, we're short on deeds for armor and weaponsmithing. So I think we're going to probably save up for that. Because everything else... Yeah, I don't really like any of that stuff. Um, okay. Why don't we... Go and do some... What is the upgrading cost for this chick again? Okay, it's kind of, it's kind of up there. We don't really have anything we need to upgrade here. Do we need any of these people? Not really, so I think we'll pass on them. Okay, things we need to do. We need to do stress relief. Judicao, we can probably put in the transept. Uh, Gray and Ripley are not bad off, bad off enough that I think they really need to go. Wellafrey could probably use a little bit, so we'll put her in the lowest level one. And I think we're all pretty well set up. So, that's another boss down, guys. And, um, yeah. That, uh, went fairly smoothly, honestly. The, the boss fight was a little touch and go, just a tiny bit. But that collector fight was pretty good. And, you know, we didn't have to camp before the boss, which I think I'm going to have to stop doing that because I think you get more benefit from camping than you do from having that extra 30% damage on one character who I didn't even have in the right party slot. I never moved her back. I'm realizing that now. And that was really dumb. But it didn't bite me, so I'll just thank my stars for that. Anyway, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you are not subscribed to the channel, please go ahead and subscribe. It'll allow you to keep up to date with this series as well as the XCOM 2 and Earthbound series, which as of this, as of this posting... There should be an episode of Earthbound up. It probably went up uh, the other day, so that's back. I'm going to try and finish that, just so you guys know. Um, if you are subscribed to the channel and you enjoyed the video, please like and or share it. Anything you do like that to show your support for the channel greatly encourages me to keep on doing this thing that I am doing. So please go ahead and do that. It is very much appreciated. Uh, anything else I need to do before we go? Let's see. Does anyone need a name? Uh, we don't have anybody above first level resolve yet, so I don't see anyone that necessarily needs a name as of yet that does not already have one. So, that being said, we're going to call it a day here. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time.